bienvenidos a un nuevo vídeo del canal y estamos aquí de vuelta con Genshin Impact y toca volver al Iyu en este caso para completar los nuevos encuentros de esta actualización 2.4 así que vamos a misiones, vamos a misiones legendarias y aquí en encuentros vamos a desbloquear en este caso el primero el de Yunjin ya que me parece más interesante conocer este nuevo personaje así que vamos a desbloquearlo nos va a costar dos llaves, las usamos y ahí está Encuentro de Yunjin, Canción de Gracia le vamos a comenzar. Vale. Parece que hay que ir al gremio de aventureros del Iyue. Ok, lo primero también que vamos a hacer, ya que estamos aquí, que no se nos olvide. Misiones legendarias. Recogemos las llaves para, tener, para desbloquear la siguiente. Y ahora sí que sí, vamos al Leo. Ya toca un poco conocer más de este personaje que hemos podido conocer gracias a la misión de interludio de la 2.4. Pero bueno, vamos a ver qué pasa. Can't you send someone any sooner? The clock is ticking and I need this resolved ASAP. I'm sorry, but we don't have any adventurers available at this instant. ¿Qué sucede? Ah, your timing is most optimal. Allow me to introduce you Ning. Manager of the Yunhan Opera Troupe. She has commissioned the guild to... Traveler? Ugh, Yunjin is always talking about you. Please, you've got to help us find her. Yunjin desapareció? Yep, she's gone and disappeared. Now of all times, just days away from the big performance. ¿A quién le has notado? Últimamente he estado hablando sobre la divina misera de la devastación con unos amigos y no me sentía satisfecha. Por eso decidí ir al paso Lingu para reflexionar. No se preocupe, volveré en unos días, Yunjin. Si nuestra audiencia no puede ver a Yunjin en la escena, se van a tirar el lugar. O sea, ¿qué voy a hacer? ¿Qué? Eso es lo que dije también, pero... Mira, cuando eres un megastar como like Yunjin, tienes que empezar a tomar las cosas un poco más seriamente. Saying she'll be back doesn't give me a whole lot of reassurance when she's showing no regard for her own safety. Why does she have to go and practice somewhere so dangerous? What if something happens to her? What am I going to tell the audience? Pero si tiene una visión. Well then, what if she gets into a scrape and hurts herself? <sighs> As you can see, this is what we're up against. Would you be willing to accept this commission? De acuerdo, lo haré por Junjin. Oh, wonderful. Oh, thank the stars. Please, you've got to bring her back. Vale. Vale, pues hay que ir al paso Ling Yu, así que como ya sabéis, esto está bastante cerca. Podemos coger y hacer el TP para llegar más rápido. Está aquí al lado, ¿no? Vale, vamos a venir aquí. Hala, guardián y... Madre mía, la que salió aquí, ¿no? Hay un guardián... Eh... Sal de ahí. <ríe> Supongo que tener que luchar, vale, pues vamos al lío. Beg for mercy. Useless. Wind, hear me. Crush. ¿Estás bien? ¿Estás herida? Oh, it's you. Ahora me reconoce. Top. I do apologize. I didn't see you there. ¿En serio? What brings you all the way up here? Oddly enough, I was just thinking of scheduling a meeting with you later. I didn't expect to run into you here of all places. Me envía tu representante. Ah, oh, I see. 
So Yunning sent you. I did tell her not to worry. Oh, but on this occasion, it seems I'm rather lucky you came. You've helped me avert a major catastrophe. It's a pity, though. I was so close to achieving the state of mind that Shenhe was talking about. Do you remember what Shenhe said about the Divine Damsel fighting against the evil monster? That in reality, she hadn't acted as courageously as the operatic rendition would have you believe. Granted, she later admitted that she preferred the version of events given in the opera, with its portrayal of a divine heroine sacrificing herself for... But after giving it a lot of consideration, I think that this character is defined by her emotional complexity, and even uncertainty. So the more emotions I can experience for myself, if access to a different state of mind can help me provide a fresh interpretation of the character and her actions, that's why I came here. My plan was to take it slowly. Start by just dipping my toe in as it <sighs> I feel like I was so close to a breakthrough here. Es demasiado peligroso. Considering the Vamos rewards that I could reap from this experience, the risk is negligible. Still, if I choose to continue, this is unlikely to be the last time I... Hmm. I suppose I had better return to Liyue Harbor for now. I'll only end up putting you in an awkward position otherwise. Eso es cierto. I wonder whether I have gained anything useful from this trip. Vale. Pues parece que ahora nos toca regresar con ella a Liyue, así que volvemos al gremio aventureros. Y vamos a ver qué ocurre ahora. Como ya sabéis, en este tipo de aventuras conversacionales, lo más importante al final es desbloquear todos y cada uno de los finales y ver un poquito las, eh, lo que son los caminos no diferentes que vamos a ir tomando. Como siempre, primero completaremos el primero que salga y luego vamos a ir buscando el resto de finales. Y bueno, empezamos fácil, de momento eh, esto es hablar con el personaje nuevo, hablamos de nuevo con el gremio y a ver un poco cómo continúa la aventura por las tierras de Liyu. More speed. Can you put a few more adventurers on the case or something? The clock's still ticking away. Please have faith in him. Ah, they've returned. Yunning, we're back. <gasps> Yunjin, are you okay? Are you hurt? Do you need to go to Boo Boo Pharmacy? Ah, <sighs> no, I'm fine. You don't need to worry. When it's time to go on stage, I'll be there. <sighs> Look, I get it. You like to go out exploring. That's fine. But do you really have to go off thrill-seeking this close to the show? You have to take better care of yourself, okay? For all our sakes, for the opera troupe and for your audience. We're just lucky we had the traveler to help out. What if something had happened to you, huh? What would I say to our audience, hmm? Well... I would say the best way to make it up to our audience is to give them the best performance we can. Don't you agree? While I'm off stage, as long as there is something, anything I can do to improve my acting ability, even the slightest amount, I can't pass up the opportunity. You know, you... you... Ugh, I don't know what to say anymore. Traveler, please, you tell her. So, what's your honest opinion? La seguridad debería ser lo primero. Vamos a ir por lo seguro primero. Exactly. Just think of all the people coming from far and wide just to show you their support. Why do you make it sound like they are coming to see me and not the show? Well, same difference, isn't it? I don't think so. They seem quite different to me. Well, either way, you're quite right. I mustn't let down our audience, especially those who came from afar. And I certainly mustn't make you come out looking for me again. So I suppose I will put my training exercises on hold for a while. Whew. I'm glad to know that the brightest star in my troop is finally going to start listening to reason. <sighs> I'm going to head back and see how the set is coming along. No Don't go disappearing on me again. <laughs> <sighs> All right. I'll head back and do some rehearsing. It's no substitute for first-hand experience, but it should still help me iron out a few issues. Es mucho más seguro. <laughs> Speaking of which, I haven't even thanked you properly for saving me. If you are free after the show, come and find me at Hayu Tea House. Vale. 
Vale, pues parece que ahora esto ya estaría. Tendríamos que reunirnos con ella en la casa de té. En este caso hay que esperar a el día siguiente, ¿no? Pero la casa del té, bueno, a ver. Vamos a ver el reloj. Tenemos que hacer doble skip porque tiene que ser al día siguiente y no, obviamente, si llegamos a la hora indicada nos va a poner que estamos en el mismo día. Así que hay que hacer doble skip de tiempo y con ello deberíamos de poder conseguir el objetivo. Vamos a ver. Me ponía de hora, espérate que no me acuerdo, a las... vale, 20.23, ok. Vamos a poner a las 20 horas. No. Oh. No, a, la, a las 9 va. Oh. Y ahora vamos a ir a donde toque. Ahí estamos, ya es de noche, así que toca ir a la casa de Tecomore. Vamos a ver. Ya debería de salirnos en el mapa indicado. Vamos a salir, estamos cerca, eh, no os preocupéis. Bueno, vamos con Xiao. Uy. La verdad que todas estas introducciones, estos encuentros con personajes nuevos creo que están bastante guay Además el personaje me ha llamado muchísimo la atención con lo que hemos podido ver Y no es lo único, también parece que tenemos evento de pociones, tenemos nuevas misiones Así que estos días el Genshin va a tener bastante, bastante importancia en el canal Bueno, aquí las texturas, lo que digo, a veces petardea y tarda en cargar Pero vamos a ver qué pasa con nuestra amiguita, la cantante de ópera Performance. I've never seen anything like it before in my life. <laughs> vale. Están aquí well, I've had the pleasure of seeing the talented Miss Yun on stage many a time in the past, but the songs still sound fresh and new every single time. It's been barely a few days since I last saw you perform. Oh, you're far too kind, both of you. I'm still new to the profession. But I promised myself when I joined the troupe that I would strive to develop myself as a performer every day. And I wouldn't be where I am now without everyone's faithful support. Nonsense, you're too humble, Miss Yun. You're a major celebrity. Who in Liyue hasn't heard the name Yun Jin? <laughs> in the circles I move in, anyone who says they've never seen Yun Jin on stage is at risk of getting laughed out of business. <laughs> As it happens, I have a business meeting at the Xinyue kiosk with a client who is also a big fan of yours. So, <clears throat> I was wondering if you'd perhaps like to join us for the meal. Oh, ah, uh, me too. I've put the table at the Liu Li Pavilion and was hoping you might join me. Oh, I'm terribly sorry to both of you, but I won't be able to make it. I'm very grateful for the invitations, but I'm afraid uh, I already have arrangements for this evening. Isn't that right, Traveler? Sí, aquí estoy. <laughs> okay, you have plans, but uh, you're really gonna pass this up. I mean, you can always reschedule. Wait a second, you're... Soy tan famoso en Well, I guess it's not going to work out today, then. Bueno. Parece que uno oh, de ellos ya se va. They took off pretty quick. Do they know something I don't? <laughs> I guess I'll be leaving, too. Wouldn't want to cramp your style. Take care, both of you. Sorry that I can't see you off. Vale, pues parece que estos se van. A toda prisa además. Vale. Thanks for coming to my rescue. Look at you. You're a national treasure. Even Gentry Mautsai is in awe of you. Hombre, me acabo de cargar un dragonaca. Can you a kiosk in the Li Pavilion? I just hope the food won't go to waste. ¿Quieres que vayamos al pabellón Liuyi? I don't think we'd be able to get a seat, but it's fine. I have a better place we can go. Let's head downstairs. I owe you a big thank you tonight. Vale. Pues nada, parece que nos va a agradecer, así que ya sabéis. Vamos al piso de abajo de la casa de té. Esto es por aquí. A ver qué pasa. ¿Concierto? Estaría guay, eh. M -m -miss Yun? Oh, wow. It's really you. Hey, get back here. Oh, Ditsy girl, you don't have a clue what you're doing. Are you a journalist? 
If you'd like to arrange an interview, you'll have to liaise with my manager. Sorry, Miss Yun. Don't mind her. She's just new and still learning the ropes. Miss Yun, I'm interested to know why you added a silk dance to the scene where the Divine Damsel makes her appearance. <laughs> hmm? You... you noticed that? Yes! Based on the original script, that scene would see your character perform the Adeptus Walk. But the addition of the silk dance meant that the... Animated. Yes! Yes! But delicate and graceful, like a crane! Uh, oh. Sorry, which publication are you from? Oh, uh, I... Ah, yeah, we're from the steam. I am Boy Yi, the editor-in-chief. Yes, yeah, We were based in Fontaine. Ah, Just de Fontaine. made the move back to Leeward. gente que, que ha estado viviendo en Fontaine. Una de las ciudades que todavía no hemos visitado junto a Sumeru, que son oh, creo I que see. las próximas, si no me equivoco. You're from the Steambird. Then it's no wonder. Your journalist has clearly done her research. That's very kind of you, but really, my level of knowledge is very basic compared. Hey, Miss Yoon is throwing you a bone here. Make the most of it, okay? Actually, I'm afraid there's somewhere I need to be. Then I'd really need to clear this interview with my manager. Será mejor que tu representante concierte la entrevista. Yes, you're right. I'm very sorry. But I'm afraid the troop is pretty strict about the rules for this kind of thing, so we'll have to do this one by the book. The Steambird is a highly reputable publication, so I'm sure my manager won't give you a hard time. But... <sighs> Fair enough. Sorry if we're being intrusive. Yes, I I'm coming. Bueno. Uh, bye, Miss Yun! Uh, hey, wait! That's the wrong way if you wanted to talk to my manager. Se fueron. Oh well, never mind. I have a friend who works for a paper. I'll ask them later. For now, though, the top priority is making good on our plans. Now that I think about it, I've turned down three social engagements tonight. Come with me. Our plan is the only one remaining. So let's. Vale, pues parece que vamos a aprovechar el plan, así que vamos a ver. Al peñasco. Pues vamos allá. ¡Oh! Corre, Xiao, corre. A ver qué pasa por aquí Como ya sabéis, normalmente en estas historias Tenemos un total de 5 finales Pero bueno I can smell the fragrance of food in the air Yes, Churhu Rock is definitely the place to go after a performance Vamos a los tres cuncos Oh, so you're regular in Churhu Rock too Third round knockout has a great view It's the perfect place to drink some tea And listen to a good story But At the same time, it's lacking a little pizzazz. Hey, have you been to Chen the Sharp's place before? His grilled tigerfish is the best around. Third round knockout and Wan Min restaurant are both great restaurants. Enjoying some nice food and drink, sitting by the hot coals in the cool breeze. Let's go. Vale, pues vamos para allá. Hay que hacerle caso. A ver, en este caso estamos aquí al lado, así que parece fácil. Es aquí, ¿no? El filósofo Chen. Hola. Tigerfish. Oh, hey there. Is this a? Yes, please. I'm out with my friend today. Vale, vamos a comer un plato de carne frita y unas brochetas a brasa. And of course, some grilled tigerfish. Y pedir la parrilla no puede faltar. Two, please. One with just a hint of chili, and the other one, uh. Igual que el tuyo. Got it. Your grilled tigerfish will be ready. Do you want any drinks with that? También sirve bebidas aquí. I don't advertise it though. Because it's just something I'm experimenting around with for. Miss Yun likes to drink with her barbecue, so I ended up getting her to try them out for me. So, would you two like some tea or? Hmm. Anything new? Well, I managed to scrounge some milk from Dongcheng next door. Dongcheng? What's that? A merchant from Mondstadt told me a while back that there's this popular drink doing the rounds there called. Take a little bit. I tried my hand at making it too, but the response has been kind of lukewarm. Still way off being ready to add to my menu. Tea with milk? Sorry, milk tea? It might not be the best thing for my throat, but if I'm just having a little taste, oh, but what about you? Anything you want to drink? Okay, let's get yours in first. I'll have one of each if that's all right. Okey dokey. And here's your tiger fish, fresh off the grill. Come on, let's enjoy it while it's still hot. Piping hot barbecue and a nice cool drink is the best sensation. 
¿vale? Terminas de comer la barbacoa con Jin Jin. ¿Le ha gustado? ¿Qué harás con el resto? ingredients Vamos a ello. Vale. Vamos tenemos que hablar con Jun Jin, así que vamos allá. Me está usando, ¿eh? Get ready. Oh, and no peeking. Mira al otro lado. It's ready. Probarlo de nuevo. De gustarlo de verdad. ¿Cómo te lo has bebido sin hacer ni una mueca? Oh, just besides, it's nothing that unusual. I think it tastes okay, doesn't it? Sabe inesperadamente delicioso. <risa> so did you work out what ingredients I added? Menta. Close, but not. No lo he adivinado. Vaya. We can try some more combinations next. <risa> I wonder what kind of new flavors I could create with some more traditional teas. I can't wait to try it out. I'm getting excited just thinking about it. La auténtica Junji no tiene nada que ver con los personajes que interpretan en escena. Oh. Well, people do often say that getting deep into a character is about identifying the part of you that is similar to them. And so in that sense, I can't say it's incorrect to conflate an actor and the character, but there are many more sides of me than the few you see on stage. So ultimately, yes, I am not the same person on stage as I am off. Sometimes, when I get letters from people, I can tell from the way they write that they see me as someone cold and aloof. I can write back, but I have to be very careful about what I say. Likewise, when I get invited along to banquets and so on, I have to make sure to keep myself calm and composed. Vale. Es una pena, la Junjin fuera de escenario es mucho más entrañable. Ahem. I bought you one drink, okay? That's not a license for you to start saying weird. <laughs> well, never mind. You seemed like you were being sincere. All I was trying to say is that everyone has many different sides to their personality. I mean, if we hadn't had the chance to hang out and chat like this tonight, There are things about you I might never have gotten to see, like the mighty and distinguished traveler diligently reviewing my hot pot drinks. Yo también habría asumido que eres una persona seria. Me? Serious? On stage, I guess. Just think of me as another one of your friends, <laughs> just one who happens to have a flair for the drink. So, friend, what shall we do next? Something to remember today by? Tomemos una imagen juntos. Get a photo? You mean? Capture this happy moment for posterity so we can look back on it later? Claro que sí. Sounds good. Let's have the food stall in the background. Hmm. Now how should I pose? A ver. Vamos aquí. Y listo. Vale, guardamos. Y con esto creo que habremos terminado una de las historias. It looks good. I hope whenever you look at this photo in the future, it will remind you of the good time we had today. Entonces, hasta pronto. Hold on. How is one photo going to be enough? We'll both need one if we want something to remember each other by. Sí, tienes razón. You take this one, and I'll take another photo of you. But could you find another location for us? I'm thinking somewhere around Feiyun. Vale, a pendiente Feiyun. I'll join you in a moment. Vale, pues va a hacernos una foto ella también, así que... Vamos allá, esto lo bueno es que está bastante cerca, no creo que sea ningún problema. Lo que digo, me está gustando como misión. Estos encuentros al final son una de las cosas más divertidas del juego, ¿no? Porque, aparte de los varios finales, 
siempre tienen esa, esos momentos ¿no? de conocer realmente a los personajes que poco a poco pues, se van incorporando al juego. Sobre todo lo que digo, los que no tienen misiones legendarias, que haya bastante. Tampoco esperé tanto tiempo. ¿Vale? ¿Que cierre los ojos? ¿Para la imagen? Vale, cierro los ojos. Get ready. Three, two, one. Open your eyes. Oh, juntos por interés en como una imagen para el recuerdo. Guardar. Vale, pues ya tenemos el primero de los finales. Ha estado muy divertido. Y bueno, nos hemos hecho una foto con la con ella. Me ha gustado muchísimo lo que digo. Eh, tenemos entonces ya eh, el final. Lo que digo, aquí como ya sabéis esto continúa y tenemos más decisiones que tomar. Así que vamos de nuevo a pulsar el botón para venir a las legendarias. Y aquí, pues como podéis ver, tenemos uno de los finales alcanzados, pero aún nos queda mucho por hacer. Así que vamos a venir aquí y vamos a ver dónde se divide la trama, ¿no? Eh, vale. Citas a medianoche. Vale, aquí eh, tenemos varios finales, por lo que veo, ¿no? Sobre el escenario y detrás de las escenas. Vale. Vamos a cargar esto. Vale, pues ahora vamos a cargar sobre el escenario y detrás de las escenas. Y a ver un poquito, ¿no? Eh, cómo conseguimos, en este caso, eh, averiguar más finales. En este caso parece que tenemos que venir por aquí. Así que vamos a hablar de nuevo con Junjin. Y a ver un poco cómo conseguimos el segundo de los finales. Como ya sabéis, hay cinco. Ya hemos hecho el primero. Vamos a ver qué pasa por aquí ahora. Vamos a ver. Esto desde cuando nos hemos juntado aquí con ella. I can't wait to try it out. I'm getting excited just thinking about it. Nunca imaginé que la Junjin fuera de escenario sería así. Oh. Well, people do often say that getting deep into a character is about identifying the part of you that is similar to them. So in that sense, I can't say it's incorrect to conf but there are many more sides of me than the few you see on stage. Sometimes when I get letters from people, I can tell from the way they write, I can write back. Vale, esto es lo que nos ha dicho antes. Tu persona es más importante sobre el escenario, es inevitable. You think so? Pobrecita. It's fair enough. After all, every detail of my onstage presence, from the songs to the costumes and makeup, is carefully crafted for maximum appeal. And I've worked hard to try and cultivate an image that appeals to everyone, regardless of age or gender. But if I can't lighten up and joke around, even with my closest friends when I'm off stage, never mind. Talking about this is just going to kill. Tonight was about me showing my gratitude to you. So, did you have a good time? Like something to remember the evening by? A souvenir, perhaps? Una imagen con un autógrafo. Okay. Here you go. Ya tenías una preparada. Well, people ask me for autographs all the time. Usually, what they want is a signed picture of me. Yunning suggested that I keep a bunch of them on hand at all times. O sea, de esta manera, easier. como que no tenemos un final tan bueno como el que hemos hecho en la primera vez, ¿no? Ah, yes. That one is a picture from the Divine Damsel of Devastation. Don't think. <laughs> I have one just like it on my wall at home. Hey, are you guys talking about Miss Yun's autograph photos? <laughs> I have one in the store too. Todo el mundo tiene una. Well, what do you think? Is this souvenir valuable enough for you? Bueno, pues nos da. Aquí está el final y nosotros en plan de se enfadado con nosotros. Un recuerdo sin sentimiento no vale nada. Lo verdaderamente memorable quizá no sea una imagen firmada. Guardar. Pues bueno, hemos conseguido ahora el final más malo, supongo, ¿no? Y vamos un poquito a venir para continuar en este caso con más cositas. Así que, como siempre, ya sabéis, venimos a misiones. Vamos a venir a misiones legendarias. Venimos de nuevo aquí a Junjin. Y ahora el siguiente objetivo debería de ser, ahora que hemos conseguido esos finales, ¿vale? De por aquí, el, lo que sería el primer final, ¿no? Vale, hay que venir a visitantes del pájaro de vapor. Supongo aquí lo que será, lo que habrá que hacer es concertar la entrevista. Así que directamente vamos allí y vamos a ver un poquito cómo avanza todo esto. Ya os digo que como podéis ver, no son finales complicados de sacar, pero tengo que decir que para conocer un poquito más de este nuevo personaje, viene muy bien que cuando introduzca un personaje nuevo no, no se lo presenten con estos encuentros. Aún así, lo que digo, también molaría misioncitas curradísimas de los personajes. Aquí ahora lo que habrá que hacer básicamente para este nuevo final es integrarnos. 
todo esto ya lo hemos visto, así que ahora lo que hay que hacer es elegir el, el camino de que le hagan la entrevista. Con eso supongo que perderemos el tiempo y no podemos tener esa conversación que hemos tenido, pero bueno, vale, esto es lo que hemos hecho. Bien. Vale. Aprovecha esta oportunidad, habla con ellos. Y aquí empieza lo nuevo. Los dejaremos para otro momento. Okay. Oh, thank you. Thank you Nos hemos so much, Great. Thank you both kindly. Let's find a quiet place and get this interview underway. Yunjin y Shinchun charlan alegremente. Oh, I see. So that's why you added the silk dance in this scene. Yes, exactly. Vale. Doing it this way not only allows for more todos los secretos de su obra. Ah, okay. So there was even more to it than I thought. So wouldn't it make sense to contrast this with the Dong Tong apasionado section that comes directly afterward by making the latter a little more sophisticated? Hmm. I think I know which section you're talking about. Ah, sorry, sorry. What am I saying? This is a fixed formula, isn't it? My suggestion would completely break the format. No, it's okay. It's an interesting idea for sure. I'll give it some thought. Thanks for the suggestion. Vale. <gasps> really? <laughs> Me siento totalmente ajeno a esta conversación. Uh, uh Shuryan, maybe it's time to move on to some of the things our readers would like to know about. Oh, okay. Um, I was also going to ask for your opinion on the set and the costumes. <clears throat> yes. Well. I'm sure Miss Yun has countless pearls of wisdom she could share on her chosen craft, but uh, not all of our readers are quite so uh, artistically literate, shall we say. A, a, a lot of them really just want to know more about you. You know, what does Yun Jin do when she is off stage? Vale. Excuse me, when I'm off stage? Uh, you know. You're a major celebrity, and a lot of our readers are interested in what kind of place to eat, ropa favorita que le gusta comprar todas esas cosas. Besides rehearsing, a day in my life isn't really any more interesting than anyone else's. Nonsense! Of course it is. Just think how many people were at your show earlier. They come from all over just to show their support. In fact, a relative of mine has a daughter who's been saying she wants to broaden her horizons recently. Oh, it's against the rules of the opera troupe to accept private gifts from. Hmm. Could someone out there be accepting gifts for the troupe under false pretenses? I must get Yunning to look into it. Uh, I, I mean, it, it wasn't a big deal. Just something she said. Uh, forget I brought it up. So I saw Gentry Maltsai and the Snezhnaya gentleman come down from upstairs. Our... So what are your thoughts on Snezhnaya? Ah, mira, le está preguntando cosas complicadas. Uh, eh? uh, I'm sorry. This is my first interview, and my notes are becoming a total mess. I might need a moment to pause and reorganize them a little. Otherwise, I'll never be able to work all this into an article. Don't be ridiculous. Stopping an interview halfway through to organize your notes? What are you talking about? Hey, hey, hey. all right, all right, all right, all right. Uh, Miss Yun, we'll just be a moment. La están liando, vamos. La periodista agarra al editor jefe y se va. Oh. Te ves cansada. I'm fine. It's not the first time I've been asked questions like these. The last time it happened, Yunning stopped the interview for me. But the next day, the tabloids were full of articles like Dramatic Exit, Yunjin Storms Out of Interview, and Miss Ladida Opera Star is Too Good for Our Questions. <laughs> yeah. So from then on, Yunning said all interview requests have to go Ahora through. Lo entiendo. I used to think I could hold the troupe together just by putting on a good performance. But now. Al público le encantan todas las cuestiones. Oh, you mean fan Arya and that crap? But there aren't many people like them who can appreciate all the nuance in a single viewing. Bueno, poco a poco, Yunin. How did sure Yun end up working with an editor like that guy? Something feels wrong there. Ugh. They could be back at any moment, so I should stay here for now. But could you go look into it for me? Yo me encargaré. If you find out anything, come straight back here. Vale. Pues nada, parece que tenemos aquí que investigar, así que. Vamos allá. 
Lo bueno es que todo está cerca. How can you be so cruel to Miss Yoon? Shh, keep your voice down. Whatever you got to say, it can wait until we're out of earshot. Aquí algo, algo raro pasa. Uh, what's wrong with you? Why can't you get it into your head? Quit asking dull questions and start thinking about how to win over our readers. Do I make myself clear? No, no I don't think you pero... realize what a golden opportunity you have here. How many journalists would give? Se me ha bobeado. Did you find anything out? Les perdí la pista. I see. It's just a bit of a sh she genuinely understands opera. If I had the chance to talk with her more in depth, it could well provide me with some fresh inspiration. No imaginé que eso era lo que tenías en mente. Yoon Jin, Yoon Jin, did you agree to another interview without notifying me? No creo, bueno, no dijo nada que fuera preocupante. Creo que si conseguimos seguirlo sin que se bugue, nos darán algún logro y demás. Os lo voy diciendo ya. These tabloid types are total sure nothing might have short of catching them all in their lair in one fell swoop. Who knows when this is going to end? I'm sorry. Well, wallowing isn't going to solve anything. Come on, go tell everyone in the troop to be extra cautious during the... <sighs> Geo Lord bless us. Spare us any more off-stage <laughs> <Son Lee>, drama. <laughs> vale. Y aquí supongo que está al final, se la llevan. Lástima que el mundo no sea un lugar mejor. Parece que Yunjin va a estar ocupada eh, por bastante tiempo. Guardamos. Y con esto ya tenemos el tercero de los cinco finales. Ya veis que no es tan complicado el ir sacándolos, pero ahora lo importante es centrarnos en la otra parte de los desvíos. Como podéis ver... Eh, toda la parte de arriba la tendríamos Aquí aún falta, ojo, aquí eh, creo que falta el que será seguirlos, ¿no? Para otro final, o sea, todo tiene que ver con esto Vale, pues vamos con rastros sospechosos Ahí está Hay que alcanzar a Shinjun y... Vale, esto ahora no hay que fallar Así que vamos a ello Esto supongo que será para otro final Vale Ya decía yo, digo, eh, digo pues pensaba que era para un logro, pero no Vale lo que digo, hay que mantener distancia, ¿eh? Uh, what's wrong with you? Why can't you get it into your head? Quit asking dull questions and start thinking about how to win over our readers. Do I make myself clear? Vale. Misión de sigilo, allá vamos. I don't think you realize what a golden opportunity you have here. How many journalists would give anything they had to trade places with you right now? Huh? Ever think about that? You... you just don't get it! Miss Yun has put her heart and soul into... Enough! Stop yelling in public! Or do you want Miss Yun to hear about all the lies you're spreading about her? <gasps> Me? You're the one making everything up. Mientras el prota aquí en plan de bueno, yo me estiro. Well, you sure seem pretty happy chatting to her. So don't act like you ain't a part of this. And don't forget the contract you signed. Ah, uh, come. We'll continue our little chat over there. You need to listen and learn, young lady. I I Are you ready to stop whining now? Do you have any idea how rare an opportunity like this is for a small time paper like ours? Just think of the sales if we can get an exclusive. <laughs> We'd have enough to cover your salary for two lifetimes. But but 
what about us pretending to be from the Steambird? Aren't you worried she'll find out? <clears throat> you really think she still would have talked to you if I hadn't told that little white lie? Hmm? Besides, what have you got to be afraid of? As long as we make it sound like an eyewitness account, how will she be able to refute it? Heck, if she actually presses the issue, I'll probably have to thank her for keeping it current for me. <laughs> <sighs> this is horrible. I will not let you treat Miss Yun like this. <sighs> I don't know who she thinks she is anyway. Oh, I sang a couple of shows, so now I'm a national superstar. Give me a break. No one wants to read about your sopranos or your falsettos. We give the readers what they want. That's how this business works. Case in point, that blonde guy seemed to be getting along pretty well with your gene. There's definitely a story there, even if there isn't. Ugh, that's enough. I'm reporting you to the military. Hey. Report me? What for? Libel? Identity theft? I... You'd better tread carefully, Missy. First, you neglect your own duties, and Así now you're trying to... You signed the contract. You know full well the consequences. If you sabotage this interview, I will make sure you lose everything you... Why? Oh, why did... Vamos a Who's there? Oh, it's you. What do you want? I'm warning you, I'll spread a lovely little story about you and Yunjin throughout all of Liyue. Wait a second. I was so focused on Miss Yun earlier that I... Huh? What are you talking... He's the traveler. You know, the one who even the Chi Sing will listen to. What the... Oh, what have I done uh, no, no need to get all worked up here. Uh, Basta we, de we mentiras. Uh, 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 yes, quite right. You are quite right. Just my luck. I'm so, so sorry. I had no idea it was going to turn out like this. Lo escuché todo, no es culpa tuya. But I'm so ashamed. I don't know how I could face Miss Yun now. So please, please pass on my apologies to her. Vale, parece que por lo menos ahora lo hemos solucionado. Vale, y ahora supongo que informaremos a ella para tener otros los finales. Me ha molado bastante, ¿qué queréis que os diga? Ha sido sorprendente y lo que digo, ¿veis? La mala... Mala trama que tenía aquí el boy, ¿eh? Poca broma. Sí, y no te va a gustar. Sin Jun me pidió que me disculpara por ella. Se lo explicamos todo. I see. Dice que me sorprende. Well, it's just a bit of a shame that I didn't get to talk with Shiryun for longer. She genuinely understands opera and has a passion for it. If I had the chance to talk with her more in depth, it could well provide me with some fresh inspiration. Que que Did vale, you agree visto, to no? another interview without notifying me? No creo que regrese. These tabloid types are total sure nothing might have come <sighs> short of catching them. <sighs> I'm well wallowing. Geo. Esto ya lo teníamos. No, entonces lo que hay que hacer es eh, avisar a. Vale, hay que avisar a Junjin. Ok, pues parece que lo que tenemos que hacer es escuchar la conversación entre estos dos. Esto hay que ir aquí abajo, ¿no? Ah, vale, ahora ya tenemos hecho. Ok, ok. Vale, ahora hay que venir hasta aquí y ahora hay que seleccionar para el momento que hemos hablado. Es importante ver esto. Vale, esto lo podemos pasar rápido, esto ya lo hemos visto. Me ha molado porque realmente aquí hay un final que hay que tener en cuenta, ¿no? Y hay que elegir muy bien la opción. Vale. Me mantendré al margen hasta que se haya contado a Junjin primero. Well, think very carefully about what you're going to do. This is a rare opportunity. Now, I need to think how to phrase these interview questions. You... Hey, wait! Vale. Vale, tenemos que informar a Yunjin. A ver cómo acaba esto. Quería hablar con ella, así que... Ahora debería salirnos alguna variante en la conversación para poder desbloquear esto. Verás. Vale, le contamos todo con detalle a Yunjin. Deberíamos reportarlos a la Geoarmada. 
All he's done so far is ask a few questions. There's... besides, if we rush to report him now, it's only going to give him more material to write about. Deben de haber más evidencias en su base de operaciones. You're right. But tabloids like theirs never have permanent offices and printing presses. Vaya. The moment they hear anything, they'll disappear without a trace. I'm actually more concerned about another detail you told me. Would you be willing to do me another favor? I want to send a letter to that journalist. Claro, yo me encargo. Great, thank you. Vale, pues escribe una carta y supongo que ahora yo se la tendré que dar, ¿no? <gasps> The editor should be here soon, so I'll stay here to deal with him. Vale. If everything goes well, we should be able to get some breathing room for a. Vale. Y ahora qué? Tenemos que entregar la carta sin Jun. Vale. Supongo que se encontrará donde siempre, así que vamos a ver. Me está molando, eh, este tipo de misioncitas. Vale. Vamos a ver qué pasa ahora. I've had it with you. Do you think contracts are just bits of paper? If we weren't on a tight deadline, you'd better believe I'd fire you right. <laughs> you will stay here and reflect on your es, actions. Es un mala you pieza, eh, Boji. Oh, what am I going to do? Espérate. Que ahora que el editor se ha ido, entramos en escena y le enseñamos la carta. The one who was with Miss Yun earlier. Yun Jin escribió esta carta para ti. Oh, really? Miss Yun wrote me a letter? Oh, hmm. Hmm. <laughs> wow. Really? ¿Qué dice la carta? Miss Yun says that under Liyue law, any penalty charge I have to pay may not substantially exceed the amount of my salary. You can't have a labor contract that would completely bankrupt the employee in the event of a breach. It's not legally binding. Oh. So not only can he not get any money off of me, I can take this contract to the Ministry of Civil Affairs and blow the whistle on him. Qué crack. I didn't think about any of this when I was job hunting. I just signed the contract without a second thought. I always thought Miss Yun was all about opera. Who would have thought she was such a legal expert too? Es increíble. <sighs> If only I hadn't gone out of my way to get Miss Yun's attention in the first place, none of this would have happened. I didn't expect it to end up with Miss Yun helping fix my life problems. ¿Puedes llevarme a su base de operaciones? Well, Mr. Boy says I'm still on probation. Plus, I give all my draft articles straight to him. So I don't have anything in the way of evidence. Quizás está planeando despedirte cuando termine tu periodo de prueba. I wouldn't put it past. But the letter says that my statement and the contract are enough to get the Millilith looking into it. If Miss Yun says so, I'm sure she must be right. Vale, pues vamos a buscarlo y a terminar esto. Vale, hay que ir a la casa de té y enfrentarnos a Boji. ¡Oh! Al final el malo siempre cae, chavales. Ah, espérate, que este ir... habrá ido a entrevistar a. ¿No? Ah, pillada. Pillada, chaval. Ok, I think I've covered this topic pretty thoroughly now. Unless you had any more questions. <laughs> well, well, what can I say, Miss Yun? You have so many wonderful qualities. Let's not quit while the ball's rolling, huh? Otherwise, I'll think of something I didn't ask later, and by then it'll be too late. So, um, hey, where is that a uh, friend of yours who was here earlier? You guys seemed uh, pretty close. Not intentionally avoiding the interview, surely. <laughs> Aquí estoy. You're finally back. This poor gentleman's been waiting for you. You, you're with Shuryun. Hey, what's going on here? Hey, Shurjun, don't forget the contract you signed. Justo estábamos hablando de eso. The traveler clued me in. This contract you made me sign, it isn't worth the paper it's written on. Isn't worth the paper it's written on? Don't be ridiculous, it's all there, clear as day. Don't you think I did my research? Research? Oh, so you're a news editor. But you also have an interest in law? <laughs> yeah, she, she, she's new, and she's making a fool of herself. She doesn't get how this all works. No, it's okay. In fact, I found myself delving into some legal texts recently. The contracts of our opera troupe are a case in point. I'd finally finished reading through the relevant documentation from the Yuehai Pavilion, so I'm just curious. How can you be completely sure that you didn't miss anything when you were recent? Uh, I'm, I'm pretty sure I read everything relevant. 
Under current legislation, the penalty terms in my labor contract are unreasonable and exploitative. Oh. I could report you to the Millilith for extortion. Nonsense! Th th that's ridiculous! My goodness. Sir, it seems that we should probably bring this interview to a close here. D d d don't listen to her! I run a legitimate business. Everything we do is above board. Oh, I have no doubt about that at all, sir. But this reminds me of a case I read about not long ago. Once you get reported and the Millilith start scrutinizing your business, not only do they look into every license you have and every work you've ever published, but everything down to your fire safety policy will... So if you don't get back now and start preparing for their arrival... Well, I mean, I don't mind continuing the interview at all. But I'd hate to take Madre up too much of your precious time. time. Uh, you... I won't forget this! Hey, where do you think you're going? El editor, el jefe entra en pánico y se va. Miss Yun, why did you stop me? Va a deshacerse de la evidencia cuando llegue. Right, and the contract I have is enough to get him arrested. <laughs> I'm not a legal expert. I haven't the faintest idea. All that was just an act, aimed at getting him to show us the way. Ah. An act? Show us the way to... Eugene, the Millilith are after him. Based on his movements, it looks like Boyi is heading back to his headquarters. <sighs> I really hope they teach these tabloids a lesson they won't forget. It sure make my life a vale, lot vale. easier. Ya sé lo que ha pasado. Yes, I had Yunning report to the Millilith while you were delivering the letter for me. Qué the crack, penalty eh? terms in Shuryun's contract are too severe. Even if they don't violate the law, I'm sure he must be taking advantage of some loopholes. Anyone who works like that is sure to have a guilty conscience. So all I had to do was put on a little show, starring the editor-in-chief of the Steambird. And now, he is sure to lead us to the solid evidence. No puedo creer que nos, hayas oculta eh, nos lo hayas ocultado también. <laughs> well, acting has to be authentic to be believable. Their little publication will go out of business in no time. I hope this gets the other tabloids to rein in their antics too. Hey. Here's a thought. Maybe we could get him to rat on Ojo, some eh, of his rival publications. Ah, I only just realized I'm... I'm going to be out of a job. Hmm. Well, would you still be interested in submitting an article to the Steambird? Well, y yes, of course. But uh, would ah, they claro really accept conoce. an article from me? Yunning, when can we arrange the next interview for? Oh, so now you're asking me. <laughs> Two days from now, morning. We're okay. Sure, you. Let's continue our discussion about tonight's play two days from now. Does this mean I get to do a full feature interview Toa. with you? Okay. I think I know what I want to write about. Thank you, Miss Yun. Don't mention it. I'm sure it will be a source of inspiration for both of us. Me ha, me ha caído muy bien, eh. Hay que decirlo. Vale, este ya está. Aquí vemos a las dos. Bueno, en este caso a la amiga super. Ilusionada, tendrás pocos amigos Vale, pues con esto guardamos Hemos completado otro de los finales Ya lo habéis visto, nos falta solo uno Y parece que es el... Yo creo que será como malo, ¿no? Porque no queda mucho, a ver De todos modos hemos desbloqueado algún logro nuevo Dadme un segundito Recuerdos del corazón Captura unas imágenes de Jun... Ah, vale, el de un momento para posteridad Muy bien Vale, pues por aquí vamos un momentito a venir a misiones Y como ya sabéis, vamos a venir a misiones legendarias Venimos a las de Junjin Y nos falta el último de los finales Así que hay que venir a crisis evitada Parece que después de esto es donde tenemos que En este caso avanzar Así que tenemos que regresar al gremio de aventuras del Iyue Vamos allá Y vamos a ver cómo va terminando todo esto Lo que digo, me está pareciendo bastante bastante interesante El conocer estos personajes con los encuentros Son divertidos y que tengan múltiples finales Pues siempre es algo que mola bastante, ¿no? Estos vídeos son largos, pero merece la pena Me lo paso muy muy bien conociendo más Y ojo, que el otro que queda es otro personaje que me interesa mucho Ningguang por fin sabremos un poquito más de una crack. Can you put a few more adventurers on the case or something? The clock's still ticking away. Please have faith in him. Ah, they've returned. Aquí estamos. Yunning, we're back. <gasps> Yunjin, are you okay? Are you hurt? Do you need to go to Boo Boo Pharmacy? Ah, <sighs> no, I'm fine. You don't need to worry. When it's time to go on stage, I'll be there. <sighs> Look, I get it. You like to go out exploring. That's fine. 
But do you really have to go off thrill-seeking this close to the show? You have to take better care of yourself, okay? For all our sakes. For the opera troupe and we're just lucky vale. we had the traveler to... Well, vale, while esto, I'm off stage, este you know, you... So? Tienes razón, Jun Jin. I'm glad you agree. Right. Then let's get preparing. Hey, hey, traveler. <laughs> vale, esto obviamente es para You've otro only final. just managed to bring Yun Jin back. Now you're taking her straight back out again? The next show is just days away. Please, if not for me, then for the sake of the opera troupe, I'm begging you. Eso no será fácil. It... <laughs> well, please, just keep her off. What are you two talking about? <laughs> you know what? It does involve you, actually. Come on, help me stall her. Que no? Oh? Well, what do you need from me? Yo quiero ser actor. Hmm? You want to become an actor? Uh, you do? Oh, <laughs> yes, of course he does. He was just telling me that he's interested in exploring his dramatic side. Right, good. Well, let's not beat around the bush. <laughs> uh, hold on. I don't know if I'm really ready to take on students yet. <laughs> Please, this is the day you've dreamed of, isn't it? You certainly talk about it enough. And look, now he's here, Dios, ready eh? and... <clears throat> okay, okay. <sighs> I am delighted that you wish to study the performing arts from me. <laughs> but the issue is, before you could become my apprentice, I'd have to get approval from the founders to do an initiation ceremony. So, for now, I'll just teach you a few basics. Informally, one friend to another, there's no need to call me master. Eh, uh, y maestra? Um, what? Don't you think that's a bit old-fashioned? Until we settle on an appropriate title. Vale. Let's meet tomorrow morning on the bridge by the sea at Fate. I'll do my vale, best. Vale, pues en el mar para la primera lección. What a relief. Vale, vale, vale. Obviamente esto es el último de los caminos que tenemos aquí, ¿no? Así que eh, vale. A las 6, 8 de la mañana. Pues vamos a tener que hacer que el tiempo pase, así que vamos un momentito con la hora. Eh, claro, aquí el problema es no debería de contar ahora, si no me equivoco. Pues claro, tiene que pasar todo un día. O sea, tenemos que hacer doble tiempo otra vez. Ay, no pasa nada, ¿eh? Vamos allá. Ojo, que a, a menudas horas estábamos aquí hablando, ¿no? Con, con la amiga. Vale, vamos allá. Ya sabéis, ahora volvemos a darle al reloj para ir a las 6 de la mañana. Ok, ahí está. Muy bien. Vale, 6 y 48 de la mañana. Ahí estamos. Ya ha pasado un día, que es lo que importa. Y ahora sí que sí, debería de salirnos. Ahí está. Está cerca, no, no está muy lejos Veo que han metido nuevos personajes, ¿no? En todas estas zonas Eso me mola bastante Vamos allá Uepa. A ver qué pasa por aquí Importante De momento me está gustando muchísimo Sí Punctuality is an essential quality If you want to make it big in the acting world Without it, you won't be able to keep on top of all the work you need to do each day Bueno, ¿por dónde empezamos? Well... First, I'd like you to answer me one question. How many pigeons flew from the bridge when you were passing through? Eh, ¿Cuántas palomas volaron cuando pasaste por el puente? Creo que eran siete, ¿no? Uh -huh. Yes, that's right. Uh, anyway, clavado, ¿no? the point of this question was to... Eyes are the medium for the transfer of emotion. You must train your eyes to be bright, active, and strong. Watching the birds fly, hover around, and come into land will not only exercise your eyesight, Tendré but also cultivate. Indeed, my own daily training routine starts right here. I watch the pigeons to train my eyes, and I sing to the tide to train my voice. Entonces también tengo que entrenar mi voz. All in good time. Grasping all the techniques involved in opera singing and posture is not an overnight process. Let's start from the very beginning. With some general theories to help you better understand the concept of performance. Teorías generales. Of course, I am in written correspondence vale, with es performers ¿no? from many nations in Tibet. For example, hmm, algo simple. How would you perform yourself? Try to relive the events of that day when you were battling against an ancient god <laughs> and fighting off the Fatui. What can you see now? 
I want you to look out at the ocean in front of you and recall the raging waves and the atmosphere of peril from... Take a deep breath. Now, gradually, embrace the scene, immerse yourself in it, and let all the emotions back vale. in. El miedo de ser dominado por un dios antiguo. Good, good. Next, I'd like you to focus on the goal you wanted to achieve at that time. Sobrevivir y continuar mi viaje. Good, yeah, okay. Good. No, oh. stop. Wrong. This is all wrong. Granted, the character you are trying to portray is your own self. I couldn't hear you fighting for your life while gargantuan waves were crashing all around you. What I heard was the sound of someone doing vocal exercises by the beach on a calm day. Bueno, estamos en la playa, es un día sereno. Here's the thing. When you're acting, it's not only about getting into character. You also have to recreate the scene in your mind. <laughs> Now, I appreciate that you did actually experience this particular scene for yourself, but maybe conjuring up specific details of your surroundings at the time is a little too advanced for novices. Bueno, era una situación de vida o muerte. Hmm, you're right. If we were looking for an environment to help evoke the emotions you felt at the time, I suppose we could try again. A little farther afield. No hace falta ir tan lejos. Uh, oh, too far away? Hmm. Don't worry, I was just thinking aloud. Let's try something else. Come with me to the suburbs just north of Liyue Harbor. No debe estar muy lejos. If you've got no objection. Vale, pues parece que tenemos un nuevo sitio al que ir. Y en este caso, eh, bueno. A ver, un poco, un poco lejos está, hay que decirlo, pero bueno. Vamos a ver. ¿Qué pasa aquí? Me ha molado bastante, es lo que digo. Eh, son misiones. Divertidas para ver finales eh, Vamos avanzando en la historia Y al final está bastante guay por eso, ¿no? Porque lo disfrutas, te lo pasas bien Conoces más a los personajes Y es una de las cosas que más me gustan del Genshin Impact Tengo que decirlo Probablemente lo próximo que traiga no sea encuentro Sino que sea una de las misiones estas nuevas que tenemos O algo de lo del evento Y luego ya traiga el otro encuentro Y finalmente nos vamos a la zona nueva Que es lo que más ganas tengo de explorar Pero bueno, vamos primero a terminar esto Que está muy top me estoy pasando The battle you fought on the Jade Chamber was a very strange set of circumstances. I know it's hard to recreate every facet of the experience, but what vale, you can try is to tope, replace no? the foes you faced in that scenario with ones you are much more familiar with. Vale, reemplazar. I'll give you an example. Let's say you're performing a scene where your character experiences the grief and pain of a death. Well, you can replace death with another more familiar scenario. You bust a gut trying to find a treasure chest, only to finally reach it and find it filled with cabbages and radishes. <risa> Repollos y rabanos. Oh, la tristeza. Puedo sentirla. Ah, now you're catching on. Action scenes work the same way. But if you're replaying the kind of actions you perform every day, you just need to let go and your subconscious will guide you through. Come, show me how you normally fight. Vale. ¿Dónde están? Son estos, ¿no? They're coming. Just do what you normally do in this situation. Ahí está la buena lucha. Ojo. Crush. Blood of frost. Beg for mercy. Barely a scratch. Ah, me ha quitado el. Sí, me lo ha quitado literal. Crush. Barbados. Barbados. Shut up. Ya. Lament. Vale. Bueno. Ha estado guay la pelea. Oh, that was wonderful. Ah, just like a real adventurer. Soy un aventurero de verdad. Let's perform the scene again now, while the battle is still fresh in your mind. Vale. Yunjin coloca las pantapájaros a tu alrededor. Look at those red-clad scarecrows, but I want you to see them instead as those fatui who now. Let us reenact the battle on the Jade Chamber. It's okay if you can't recall the events clearly. You can just replace them with the movements you are most familiar with. And... Attack! <clears throat> the three Adepti are manning the Guizhong Ballistas. 
Vale. Vale, estoy a espantar a los rojos. Vale, uno menos. A ver qué pasa ahora. ¿Qué tal? I can't fault your movements in turn, but Fatui are larger than most monsters. I don't think it was a conscious decision, but you were aiming a little too low. And you also didn't strike with enough force. Veteran practitioners of this acting method are able to adjust and embellish their real life experience enough, but adjusting deep rooted habits to adapt them for the stage, that's no easy task. No suena nada fácil, eso es verdad. This was only your but judging from your movements, I think this next method might suit you a little better. ¿Qué método? Choreograph every aspect of your onstage performance in advance. Every you can reference existing characters from opera or if, in short, vale. you want to pin down every detail of the character you want to portray in your mind. And then work through them methodically. Es un poco difícil de entender, eh. Break, well, in your case, What you need to do is imitate your past self. Think vale. of yourself not as you, but as somebody outside this world controlling your life. Me está petando la cabeza, move. eh. Cada vez es más difícil de entender, Junjin. <laughs> It's complicated to explain, but okay. How about we start by setting a the Fatui in red when to attack the Guizhong ballista. What you want to do is evade all the blues and go straight for the reds. Vale. Yes, I think that sums it up. There's an open area to the north. When you finished rehearsing every Vale. Tenemos que prepararlo entonces. Ve el escenario que Jim preparó. Está bastante cerca, así que no creo que haya ningún problema. Oye, tengo que decirlo, eh. Se la han currado muchísimo esta quest, pero bueno. More speed. Vamos a ver qué ha preparado aquí nuestra amiga. Ah, mira, esto de aquí que parecía un escenario. Por fin tiene utilidad. More speed. A ver. Well, have you finished rehearsing? Estoy listo, eso creo. No need to rush. I shall guide you with my voice. Vale. Me pone muy nervioso cómo, cómo canta. Entre si la cámara. Vale. Oh, tío, es que de verdad me pone muy nerviosa la, la voz de, de, de cuando canta así. Es como que, no sé. Me parece que está curradísimo, pero es como que esa voz me pone muy nervioso. No sé por qué. Más allá. tocado casi todos, pero bien. Ya está, ¿no? Ah. Ha petado. La paz ha sido restaurada. <ríe> Madre mía. Now that was a little... <ríe> My hard work coaching you has finally paid off. This method might not sound as sophisticated and exciting as the first two. Rigorous rehearsal and vocal training is at the core of this school of thought. As long as vale. you practice diligently, with time... You will achieve mastery one way or another. People say that when you truly master the art of singing, even the birds and beasts will be drawn to your song. Increíble. I know. I guess I still have a long road ahead of me when it comes to developing as a performer. Entonces, si este es el método para principiantes? Well, because even if I had, you wouldn't have put your heart into it. Ojo. It's been written on your face this whole time. <clears throat> Me atrapaste. <laughs> Don't forget that acting is my bread and butter. Did you really think I wouldn't be able to see through it? Still, this is a rare opportunity, and I hope you have at least learned something from it about the beauty of the performing arts. The operatic tradition carries countless historical memories within it. As long as the art is kept alive, the voices and faces Vamos, of no bygone heroes can momento. be... I hope that your voice and your face will make their mark on Li Yue Opera too. Mi voz y mi rostro? Yes. As well as coaching you today, I have also been closely observing every move you make. Do you remember the basics of the final method? 
Tomar como referencia a otros personajes de la ópera. Nos la colado y mistea. Brutal. Estudiarme te ayudaría a lograrlo. Because as far as I'm concerned, the immersion method, drawing on life experiences, and even if my every movement is rehearsed to perfection, I can't move the audience without. And even if I fully master the character's emotions, a little choreography will help make the performance more polished. Whatever the method vale. is, as long as it offers something that can improve my performance. Thank you for trying them out as well. It means a lot to me. Gracias. ¿Cuándo será mi ceremonia de graduación? Graduation ceremony. Todavía nos queda un largo camino, vale. Still for now, I hope to incorporate part of you into my performance of the Divine Damsel. When that day comes, I hope you will be able to join me on stage and give me some constructive criticism. Claro. It'll take a lot of hard work to reach the point where you're ready to go on stage, but I'll be here to keep you on track every step of the way. Vaya, qué maestra tan estricta. Oh, here we go again. Then again, I suppose I will have to give you a lot of instruction. And if I won't let you call me master, teacher or coach, I've got to think of something you can call me. Ah, I've got mentor. What do you think? Vale. Ya la sé, aquí está el final o oh, sole mío. Desbloqueado uno logro trofeo y lo que digo, es hora de recoger las buenas recompensas de esta misión, de este encuentro. Así que venimos aquí y ya sabéis, venimos acá, le damos a recoger recompensas del final y vamos a tener un total de 60 protogemas, eh, 500 puntos de experiencia aventureros y un par de platos y libros de experiencia que nos van a venir genial. Con todo esto completado, además, ya sabéis que podemos venir a logros y coger el nuevo, trofeo, el nuevo logro trofeo que hemos desbloqueado, que es este de aquí. Ahí lo tenemos. 20 protogemas más. Muy bien. Y lo que digo, espero que os haya gustado el vídeo, que os hayáis pasado en grande, que os haya gustado este nuevo personaje. Y qué puedo decir, nos vemos en el próximo vídeo de Genshin Impact. Gracias por estar hasta el final. Adiós.